hey you guys and welcome back to my channel Alyssa the adventure and today i have a super fun and exciting video for you and for me today i'm going to be showing you all of the rarest fidgets in my collection so they may not be rare to you but they are sure rare to me so um without further ado let's just jump right into today's video also make sure to like and subscribe for future videos P.S.D. guys, I'm going to give you a warning ahead of time because my brother is crazy. I mean, crazy. He is like, oh my gosh, he's so, oh, he's like um, very active right now. So if you hear any background noises, that's my brother screaming on the top of his lungs, even though I warned him like 17 times to stop. So leave a thumbs up in the comments, not comment section, at least leave a thumbs up on the video, subscribe for my crazy brother. Do you hear that, you guys? That's my brother. He is crazy right now. So if you guys have a sibling and you know what it's like to be annoyed by a sibling, please subscribe and like because he's just crazy right now. Like crazy. So I'm so sorry ahead of time for any noises. Like screaming because if you guys know what a sibling annoying sibling is like like and subscribe for my pain that he is giving me during this video so like and subscribe for that oh my gosh you guys oh you guys he's annoying yeah i'm sorry so the first fidget that i find rare is the among us um dimple as you guys can see it is so cool it also makes amazing popping noises. This is one of the rarest fidgets in my collection, but it was also one of my first fidgets, so that's also really cool. I started out with a really rare fidget. And I really love my Among Us Dimple. I find it really stress relieving at certain times and I really do enjoy playing with it. It is so fun. So yeah, my first rare fidget in my collection is the Among Us Dimple. I totally recommend this if um, you like to, how do you say, if you like to like pop it and stuff in that pop it variety, dimples are for you. Well, yeah. Because dimples are like the more hard shell versions of poppets, but there's not a lot of poppets in the dimple. Um, you know what I'm trying to say. But yeah, poppets are similar to dimples. So if you like poppets, um, you might like dimples too. So I totally recommend this Among Us dimple for you. Next fidget toy. Okay, so um, then we have um, this. It's like a um how, how do i say this it's like a dimple digits as you guys can see it's not like the exact rainbow as a dimple digits is but it's similar to a dimple digits um but mini it's like a mini dimple digits spinner as you can see it's a spinner as well and that's also really fun and it pops just like a dimple digits would but it's a little hard if you have like big fingers um because there's really small holes that you need to pop but it pops really well. So yeah, I totally recommend for you, if you like fidget spinners or like dimple digits and mini fidgets. So I totally recommend that for you. On to the next fidget toy. Okay, so from there we have the, um, another dimple spinner, but this is like the more classic version, I should say. As you guys can see, it's really very pretty and it pops really well as well. And I really like it. So I totally recommend this for you too, if you like the uh, the mini dimple digit spinner. But yeah, I also think like these things are really rare because they're so fun. So I totally recommend that for you too. 
<laughs> this is kind of turned into a recommendation video, but I'm trying to show you these rare things because they're so rare to me because I can't find them anywhere else. But yeah, let's move on to this. Uh, this is not as rare, but I still consider it rare. Um, it's this hard shell popper thing. I call the hard shell pop its poppers, um, but this one is the heart one and it has the alphabet on it and that's so fun and cool it also makes really good popping noises um i really enjoy popping this one i feel like this one is more there uh, like it's more sensory because of the letters on it and it makes a better popping noise than the regular ones i don't know if it's because of the hard shell or what but this is like an amazing popping sound and i for one love it so on to the next thing okay you guys so i know these aren't really rare anymore but they were back in the day which was like two weeks ago three weeks ago i don't really know <laughs> um but for me back in the day these were really popular and i was like really quick to the trend of fidget jewelry so i had to get one of these the popper bracelet i don't know you guys are these still popular uh trending are these still like rare to you guys pop it bracelet pop it wristwatch wristband i don't know whatever you guys want to call it but yeah i still haven't figured out how to wear this actually um i've had this for like quite a while already Ready and I haven't figured out how to wear it um, but I'm hoping to figure that out soon it has a quiet side and a loud side just like a pop it should this is the loud side um, and it snaps really well but the quiet side it doesn't really make any noise so yeah if you guys know how to wear this please like tell me tell me how to wear it because I want to wear it like everywhere um, but the problem is I can't wear it if I don't know how to wear it so tell me how to do it tell me how to wear it because uh, I don't know how to do it I don't know how to wear it I bought it without knowing how to wear it, and that was a mistake. But anyways, on to the next thing. Okay, you guys, the next thing, where is it? Oh, right over here. Over here, we have the triple dimple. They're selling these everywhere now, too, so they're not really rare anymore. But, yeah, I have this one, and it's a keychain one. So fun. Um, it has a loud side and a quiet side, like a poppet and a dimple. I don't know, some people say that dimples only have a loud side, but I think, in my opinion, that they have a loud side and a quiet side. This is the loud side, and they are so, so fun to play with. The quiet side doesn't really make any noise, though, um, but the loud side is so, so fun like a dimple should be and yeah so this triple dimple is a really fun thing and the keychain obviously adds extra props and points to this thing because who doesn't love a good keychain fidget i mean i know i do you guys gotta love a keychain fidget too because yes keychain fidgets are the best because you can just like attach them to your backpack or wherever you want to so on to the next fidget next fidget okay i have to lean back a little to get this one um it's on the very back of my uh table thing um these were popular um a while back are they so popular magnetic rings you guys i don't know um these were like a really popular fidget a while back but i don't know if they still are really popular but they're uh, magnetic rings um that's what they're called and they're really self-explanatory they're literally rings like you can wear them and they're magnetic as you guys can see ready hold on um let's ready three two one see they're magnetic it's not really there's not really much to them except the insides are rollers so you can just roll them around on your finger and they're really quite fun to play with um i got this one it's a set of three in blue and i just love fidgeting around with these i don't really know how to play with them but i just really like fidgeting around with them um they're really fun in my opinion so whoa 
Uh, I did not expect that to happen, but yeah, it came in a set of three, and it was a really good price, so I thought I'd have to get this one because it's so fun and cool. So yeah, magnetic rings, you guys. Definitely recommend. Okay, you guys, so I don't really know if you'd include these as stress balls, but I'm going to. I have my wall balls right here, you guys. Who doesn't love some good wall balls? I think these are rare because I have not found them anywhere else except for Lake Shore. So, you guys, they are so fun. And listen to those noises. Listen to the noises, honestly, you guys. I mean, wall ball ASMR is, like, the best. I love wall ball ASMR. I need a better name for these because wall ball isn't, like, doing it for me. You know, these are really good ASMR products, and wall ball just isn't doing it for me. So I'm going to find a better name for these. Something not wall ball. But these are really good products right here. Wall balls. They are so sticky. I'm going to throw one on the roof. I'm gonna throw one, cause I don't know. I feel like throwing it, you know? I'm gonna see if it sticks to the wall, ready? Oh no, ha! I threw it, you guys. I didn't stick, I wish it did though. Look, ready? Three, two, one, ha! No, it sticks for like a second, but it doesn't stick really to the wall. I wish it did though. But no, it doesn't really stick to the wall. But these are my wall balls, and I think they are so fun. Um, look at you guys. They are so cool. But I'm including them in my stress ball portion because I think they're really rare and fun to play with. So, yeah. Wall balls. Um, you guys, wall balls are great. Okay, you guys, next fidget, um, we got this, um, it's like a mint green and pink, uh, squishy pineapple with Orbeez, clear Orbeez inside, and you guys, it is, like, so cool, look at that, you guys, you can't tell me that's not amazing, I love these like pineapple stress balls and they are so rare to find. So I love this pineapple stress ball. Ow, that hurt my head. <laughs> I, I, I am ice cream too loud. Oh my God, you guys, look at the pineapple stress ball. I am just so excited for this. I just love pineapples and I love stress balls. So pineapple stress ball is a big hit in my heart. I love the pineapple stress ball so much. Squeezing it is like an arm exercise on its own though because it's, whoa, really heavy as well as um, really like um, dense almost. It's just really hard to squish, but it feels really nice at the same time. It's just weird. I love it though. I like 100% love this. <laughs> On to the next fidget. Okay, you guys, so you know how I told you at the very start of the video that I'm sorry for my brother who is like screaming as loud as he can. Right now he's actually starting to annoy me and I've locked myself up in my room to try to, um, to try to, like, um, to try to, um, like, like, block out the, the noise, but he just turned up his volume 10% more and he's, like, like, trying to annoy me at this point in time and I'm just trying to fidget my way calm and I am getting so stressed out and annoyed by him because he's, like, ah! show you um or tell you and maybe you show some sympathy for me and like and subscribe because my gosh i really need i i, I need like um i need something to afford like noise canceling headphones because sometimes he just like he's he's really he's really that that, that annoyed that much annoying so yeah i'm sorry to interrupt again but let's move on Okay, so now we have this huge, like, um, huge, like, Dumbo Nido stress ball thingy. Um, I bought it from Hobby Lobby, and it's featured in Fidget Hunting at Hobby Lobby video. Um, oh, no, 
Did it hunting at Party City video, and that is so fun. It's like a mega gumball needle almost, and it's so huge, and I love it um so much. It's incredibly huge, and it's just awesome. So I definitely love this a lot. Um, it's like a huge gumball needle almost, and it makes farting noises too. Like, did you hear that? That's all the needle. Like, you guys, it's humongous and jumbo, and it won't even fit in the palm of my hand. It's so huge. But I love it. You know, your girl loves it. So, yeah, I love that. <laughs> On to the next, possibly last fidget toy. All right, you guys. I think we're coming to an end here with this recent one. I just recently purchased this one at Claire's. So, Go to your local Claire's because this is just awesome. It's another stress ball. Um, it's so cool. It's a neato, actually. And go to your local Claire's to get it because it's the kitten neato, kitty cat neato, and it is just so fun. It is awesome. You guys, you cannot tell me you do not love that kitty cat neato. It's adorable. You know, it deserves its own show. Purple kitty cat needle. Purple kitty cat. Purple kitty cat needle. I love my purple kitty cat needle. She is adorable. And she has a little tail and everything. I love her. She is adorable. So, yeah. Um, she is so fun to play with and squeeze. Yes, it's a she. Is our cat, cats a she? Or is it going to be, can it be boys too? I don't know. That's a, that's a, that's a, it might be a bad question because some of you guys might be obviously duh something, but, um, I don't know actually. So yeah, this one's make fart, fart noises too. See? It's really fun. I don't know. I just like making, um, noises with these needles. So yeah, they are so fun to fidget with. So I totally recommend this as well. Yes, you guys, look, that is so fun. So definitely recommend as well. So yeah, you guys, that is the last thing featured in my video. So thank you guys for watching it and I will see you all next time. Make sure to like and subscribe for a sibling and if you, you know, that sibling sometimes gets on your nerves, um, like and subscribe. Show me sympathy. <laughs> but I will see you all next time. Bye!